Hey, my name is Mike Curry. I'm the general manager of Steel Hyundai, part of a large auto group. Thanks for checking out my Career Week video and for having an interest in business and entrepreneurship. Let me tell you a bit about what I do by answering the questions that were sent out to me. Well, question number one. How'd you get into your field of work? Education, apprenticeship, etc. What did your career path look like? I wouldn't say it was completely typical, but it all started with my strong interest in cars. Plain dinkies, posters on my bedroom wall, looking at pictures and magazines, stuff like that. I wanted to take a career path that would give me access to awesome cars, pay well, and provide the lifestyle I wanted. I took the auto mechanics course at NSCC, which kicked off my automotive career. My career path to where I am today might you know seem a little odd but I feel it's important that I've worked in multiple positions throughout the automotive industry to become a lot more well-rounded and makes me better as a business leader today in the automotive field. It also allows you to become a more valuable team player as you work your way up the ranks. So question number two is what does a typical day look like at your job or in your field in general? Do you have to travel, hours of work? Well, no day is typical. I'm the type of person that likes to be in early, greet the staff, and set up my day before most of the other staff arrives. I plan every day and work the plan. Top of mind for me is how I'm gonna bring customers into the dealership. No two days are the same. I start with a look at what business we are predicting for the day and a financial review, then meet with the managers, plus walk around and talk to employees, and then as the day moves along, I'm often meeting with customers and stepping into the various departments wherever I can help. I'm constantly thinking about ways to drive business. Ways that, you know, that can mean stuff like um, self-improvement courses, lots and lots of reading, and looking at ways to incorporate innovative new ideas into our current business model and really start to think about different things like social media, like we started a TikTok account this past year, and we've been using a lot of video in sales and our service departments, as well as advertising. To be in my line of work, you need to be a visionary. Think big, not how we're doing business today, but how we will be doing business in five years, 10 years and behind, beyond. Specific hours of work generally turn into a lifestyle choice when you run a company. In my field, you don't have to punch a clock, but I do keep regular business hours that would be considered fairly typical. But when I'm on business trips or working on social media content, that can happen at various times of days or night. The truth is that if you enjoy what you are doing, it never really feels like work. As far as travel goes, I get to go on some really cool business trips. For example, last year I went to Miami, Las Vegas, Montreal, and Vancouver. All expenses paid. And question three, what's your favorite part of your job and what is the most challenging part of your job? Well, it's the favorite part, be access to amazing vehicles, helping customers with transportation problems, and training and developing employees so they can achieve their career and life goals. The most challenging part is I am required to make a lot of decisions and unfortunately, they do not always make people happy. I always do what I feel is in the best interest of the business, employees and customers. However, all my decisions are not popular. Question number four, what are the job prospects and earning potential for someone in your position or field? Well, I gotta say, if you learn how to run a business, the job prospects and earning potential are fantastic. In my business, we keep people mobile, so it is important work that needs to be done in any economy. Transportation is an essential service, and it allows for a broad range of jobs within that one field. So, question five is, please share any other career advice, ideas, students who will be entering the post-secondary or a job in the next few years? Well, I gotta say, whatever job you have, do it to the best of your ability. Become the MVP of your work. Provide extra value. If you shovel snow, make sure you go right to the edges of the driveway. If you mow lawns, edge the sidewalks with a whippersnapper. 
If you work in a restaurant, learn all the positions. Dream big. Always visualize the end goal, not where you are now. That place is just a stepping stone. Ask questions of business leaders. People who run companies are always looking for future re leaders. Do not be afraid to ask for advice. Thanks a lot for watching. I appreciate it.